Breast cancer has become such a curable illness, and so we really want to be very thoughtful about minimizing radiation dose to any normal structures nearby. For women with left-sided breast cancers, there is a theoretical risk that low doses of radiation can increase the long-term risk of cardiac disease. We're very excited, again, for the appropriate patients to be able to offer something called a line RT or vision RT. It's a way where patients can be treated during the respiratory cycle where they hold a breath for about 25 seconds and we can monitor where the heart is during those 25 seconds. If the heart of a patient with left-sided breast cancer pulls away from the chest wall, we will then decide to treat the patients during this what we call deep inspiration. There is no, nothing glued on the patient, taped on the patient, holding the patient down. There are, again, imaging cameras in the ceiling that can track respiratory motion. And so for the right patients, when they're being treated with this deep inspiration breath hold, we monitor them, we tell them when to hold their breath, and we deliver the radiation during that part of the respiratory cycle. And when the patient then exhales, the machine turns off. That's one of the many things we have to offer at St. Barnabas Medical Center to individualize patient care for our patients with breast cancer. Another technology that we also have for appropriate patients are treating them on their bellies or in the prone breast position. We brought this technology to New Jersey 19 years ago and we're one of the first in the state to offer this technology for appropriate patients. Again, it's a way to pull the breast out of the, um, off the chest wall so that we individualize each patient that we see. We individualize their anatomy, where their tumors are, and decide the best way to approach our patients, the patients that we care for at St. Barnabas Medical Center.